When traveling India, you can't help noticing the holy men, the ascetics and mystics called Sadhu Babas. Four to five million of them, they have chosen the life of self-sacrifice, life without possessions, comforts or sensual pleasures. They fast frequently and eat only vegetarian food, as they believe in ahimsa, non-violence. So what makes India special is that here these occult rebels are widely respected. Of course there's some sneaking deacons amongst them as well, guys who make business of begging or enjoy the freedom from responsibilities without true spirituality. But the real sadhus, they devote themselves to God by, for example, keeping quiet or standing constantly for 12 years. Which sadhu sect do you belong to? I am Aghori. There is also two way in Aghori way. One is Ghor and another is Aghor. We have heard that uh, some Aghori uh, eat human flesh. Is this true? Yes, true. Aghori take the flesh, the uh, body, human body, eating and drinking. But I am 100% pure vegetarian. Fully sattik way I made the karma. Where do they get this human meat from? In the burning place way, their dead body is burning. Sometimes of some aghori is also making some dead, dead bodies just like flying in the Ganga, in the up of the water. How about uh, human sacrifice? We have heard that sometimes it still happens in India. It used to happen in history. Have you heard about this? That depends on the life. They are sometimes making wrong karma. If you making good karma, then nobody, no ghost kill you. And who take the bad karma, he is go to hell. Who made the good karma, he is go to mix with the gods. But human body's phrase is the good test. I know somebody also told me. 